Have you called for somebody for a handkerchief? Have I, have I called for my handkerchief? Uh-huh. I'm like, how can we play for it this morning? Yeah, well, I, 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 I was actually having a lot of pain in my, my elbows and whatnot. Okay. Is it hurting right now? And now. Hear the Lord saying, hear the Lord saying, hear the Lord saying, that the miracle that you've been standing in the gap waiting for, that the miracle is on its way right now. And Music. It's either your body or your Ice cream. Right now, did you feel that? No, I didn't feel that. Because remember when Mr. Softy would come into your neighborhood and you hear the music going that draw the children and that they run after the truck only to get the goodies. This is the same kind of situation in these churches today, where you're hunting the message, you're hunting something, you want things. Here's an ice cream drop. Softy. Beware. Be careful. Multimedia business empire, all based on Christianity, a product that, according to Jake's, almost sells its So, with all these ice cream men out there, what are you gonna buy? Are you gonna buy their flavors? They have more than 31 flavors. And there's ice cream women out there too. Pippin' and hoeing the product. They call Yeshua Yahweh, Yahweh and the Rock Kodesh the product. You can't pimp God and you can't sell God. So, in the interest and the process of interrupting your program, Jesus is in a manger. Just remember, they will twist everything to make it sound good, to make it taste good, to make it look good, so you can buy it, because this is the brain of God. I'm not buying it. I don't need ice cream now. The camels are coming. The camels are coming. Did you hear what I told you? The camels are coming. Peace. I want to receive an offering. I want you to get your best offering in your hand right now. <laughs>